Taurus, Taurus, Taurus. Hi, Taurus. Welcome to Blue Hill Tarot. We're going to do an overview for August 2024. Uh, let's see, what do we have to say? The universal numerology for August is the number seven. Uh, the tarot card for the month of August 2024 is the tower. This, uh, the energy I'm picking up on is, uh, you know, a lot of awakenings going on around all of the sun signs. Uh, the new moon is on the 4th in Leo. The full moon is uh, on the 19th in Aquarius. So if you connect with the energy of the moon, and I hope everyone does, at some point they understand it's, it really is uh, a connection. Uh, set your intentions. Start to get prepared to do that. Messages for Taurus. I will throw tarot, oracles, and uh, maybe some destiny. So I hope you'll stay for the whole reading, and thank you for stopping. Uh, if you like this channel, please subscribe. Uh, if you have time to comment, I really appreciate that. And apparently, um, oh, the hermit fell out. That may be you. Maybe a Virgo around you. Uh, so, uh, Taurus, if you hit the like button, apparently that may help my channel. So, here we go. Taurus, Taurus, Taurus. Messages for Taurus, August 2024. Messages for Taurus. First messages, wow. So beautiful. Taurus, you've got support around you. Um, this is an energy that says even if you don't talk to them every day or you never talk to them at all, uh, you've got people around your uh, energy that are always willing to be there and hold you up high. Uh, there's nothing better than this, having support of people that you care about, that care about you. Uh, so there's tension also. Could be some tension around family right now, words spoken. Uh, people aggravating you with their uh, comments. You could be aggravating them also to start August. Things that are moving toward you that you have cast out. If you are a Taurus and you have put some things out in the month of July, uh, trying to bring something closer toward you, trying to succeed around something, trying to achieve something, whether it's personal, professional uh, energy, it is growing and it is moving toward you. Uh, it looks like around the uh, possibly around the week after the new moon, the energy may come where you get some information about something you've been waiting on, Taurus. The energy of you, Taurus, showing up as the Queen of Pentacles. This can also connect you with another Earth sign if you happen to have one, another Taurus, Capricorn, or Virgo. Uh, so this is a relationship. Some of you Taurus have uh, the fish in the cup energy. You may have cast out some invitations. You may have received some invitations around being connected with someone. You may already be in a personal relationship, uh, you know, that uh, is with another earth sign or it could be any sun sign at this point. But uh, there could also be some tension around those circumstances too, especially if you're in a long-term relationship with someone and they happen to be an earth sign, Taurus, you could be, uh, you know, nitpicking a little bit, or they could be nitpicking with you. It's okay. It's no big deal. The karma for August 2024 is victory. I knew that this card felt so delicious before I even turned it over. So you will have winning, winning, a winning. You will get some good outcomes around things you're waiting for. You will overcome obstacles where people around you have been nitpicking or having to speak the last word or people that are just annoying you or you annoying them. That will be overcome. If you have a relationship with an earth sign, it's, it's going to be delicious even if it doesn't feel exactly delicious today. The Fool. So good news, good energy, uh, positive outcomes. The energy of a Scorpio and the world card says some of you Taurus may be getting news and you may be moving into a new cycle, a new phase, starting a new job, going back to school, adding to your resume, making some type of a leap of faith around relationships. This is an unknown variable for Taurus for 2024 August. And it is the high priestess. Be still Taurus. Listen more. 
This is also a Cancer and a Virgo. If you have a connection with one of those, there's something around that relationship that is not quite gel yet or in the process of uh, making some movement that, uh, you know, is undetermined. It's an unknown variable. Then we have the energy of insomnia. Some of you Taurus are overthinking things that you're waiting on, overthinking tension around words spoken. Uh, let it go, you know, relax, trust and believe the universe has a plan. Final energy is the hope and inspiration card, Taurus. It absolutely speaks to positive hope and inspiration around you. It can also be an air sign, Gemini, Aquarius, Libra. On the bottom of the deck is you, Taurus. Uh, this is you and another, uh, and a fire sign uh, around, uh, possibly a Sagittarius, but could be any other fire sign. So we do have the energy of, uh, what, a water sign Scorpio, a water sign Cancer, an earth sign Virgo, Capricorn or Taurus, a Gemini Aquarius Libra, and possibly a fire sign Sagittarius or Leo Aries. There's some type of a victory that's going to be achieved around something you're trying to accomplish where you've cast energy out. That is a good omen for the energy of all these connections. That's a all-seeing eye message for Taurus, please. All-seeing eye message for Taurus, please. Okay, so water. Uh, so the energy of water, you know, water is, is the energy of, you know, connecting with your emotions. Um, there's a message here for anything that's going on, connecting with anything that I mentioned, uh, to allow yourself to be open to change. Uh, you know, the water is flowing. The energy of the, uh, the water speaks to... Uh, you know, allowing yourself to be open to change, Taurus. That may not be exactly easy for some of you, Taurus, because you're so determined at, about what you want and how you want it. But that's a message you can take it or leave it. Now let's throw a few destiny energies here. Messages for Taurus, August 2024. Okay, so I see that some of you may be uh, dealing with somebody that is in your family, whether it's a, you know, a sibling, a, a relative, or a, a personal one-on-one -on -one relationship where, you know, you, you may be speaking some words or hearing some words about, you know, f them feeling like they've done enough, they're sick of sacrificing, it's time for you to step up, or vice versa, you could be saying to them, listen, I've done everything I can. I'm not going to do anymore. I've given everything I can, whether it's love, money, or whatever. You may be feeling that energy. It's certainly going to show up immediately in the beginning of August if this is going to uh, connect with you. So this is a beautiful energy around sensual connections. Uh, your karma and fate says that if you have physical relationships, uh, intimate relationships, Taurus, uh, in the month of August, they're really going to amp up and it's going to be beautiful for you. If you are um, a parent, uh, you're going to, uh, you know, your children are going to just be so grateful to have you. And there is the energy of possible travel, restlessness around, uh, large sums of money. Uh, you know, this, this, these things that are positive, these victories can certainly be around your finances. And uh, you know exactly what you want and what you don't want, Taurus. And that is perfectly clear here. Listen, have a great August 2024. Please subscribe to Blue Hill Tarot. Like and comment. And thank you so much for stopping. Take care.